On this particular lesson here, I will show you through the punch drill and bang all the kick in so they can understand the feeling with your partner. Now, what we're trying to do is just build you up slowly here to understanding all the basic training. That's when you got all the lesson. If you follow in full all the lesson, you start and then you get here, you can understand how to balance. Gradually, you can understand all this and you're going to the next level, it's going to be heavy duty, proper stuff. And then you're already prepared, okay? This training here, if you've got your partner there, bring them in and let's play together. Hey, boy, you check. Like I mentioned on all the training, you need to have equipment on. First, we start to have the punch drill, then you put a kick on. No equipment, can't do it. Yeah? Drop, put the side kick on. Yeah? Then you change the hand here, put the kick on. Okay, all this movement here that you need to practice first line, boom, here. Like that on the side. Here, grab like this, then the drop. Each one different, okay? Let me explain to you first, yeah? Otherwise, you can do randomly any movement, and when you get to that, it's not in order, and then when you start to work, you find certain problem. When you do the punch drill, if the drop kick, then like this, okay? If you do the side kick like this, too close, you won't be able to do that. Side kick is more, you've got more room, so you can put the power in like this. If you hear you do the side kick, you won't be able to put the power on, because you may get here, forced to work, I'm lost balance right away. So the grab the hand like this is drop kick, yeah? If you grab this hand like this, fun kick can be done, okay? If you drop the hand like this, then you do the side kick, yeah, on the side. If you want to drop the hand and both hand grab, you can do this, okay, here. Otherwise, when you start to put the fun kick coming in here, that's fine. If you do the drop kick here, that's fine, because the same line. Yeah, or you can do a chop kick up here if you want. But when you do a chop kick up here too high, it's no good. So leave it to the front kick, to the chop. Leave it to the chop kick to come into the leg here. It's better. The side kick is totally on the side to make sure you get in the leg. So you've got more movement of that. So the line of this you're learning is learning the throw properly with the hand. You don't think about the hand anymore. All you've got to think about is the leg now. Because you forget about the hand. This is where it's new neck, yeah. Forget about the hand. Okay? This is where you're like, boom, like that. And when you're understanding all this movement here, boom, on the side here, then you can start to express your feeling a little bit better. Then you can put any kick, any way, whatever you want with it, onto the person. Because you need to express that. Can you really do the movement like that properly? We're using the punch on the first level because it's easy because everybody will punch you like this. Punch me, this is what happened. Yeah, this is what happened. This is what happened, the punch drill. A lot of time people show you all this movement on a cheese cell. When do you get in, think about, when do you get in a fight? And I do this. <laughs> when the hell are you gonna get into the fight? Let's do cheese cell together. Huh? When do you think you're gonna do that? It's not, we're not gonna do cheese cell, but it's not yet. We do them later, advanced level, because it's designed specifically for certain reason. So don't need to get too exciting yet. Play with the basic first and listen to what I teach you so they can understand good. When you get and understand that, move freely. Okay, moving around and understand the line. When you understand the line of the body, then you can expect the kick coming in. You have kick coming in, movement. When you come in a movement like this, this is where your problem. Because your leg is not in a line, this is the problem. Line, boom, in here. Change the line, boom, in here. Work with this is like learning, boom. Come on the side, drop the side, boom, here. Make sure the movement on the line is properly done and work with this is more into the movement. Don't know what's going on because it just happened naturally into the line like this, okay? Okay, boom, here, boom, here, boom on the side here, may here, may here, this doesn't matter. You can basically boom here, boom here, boom here. Up to you, thank you. It's need to how to work with this. When do you understand how to work with this movement? Anything come along? Then you can start to do them properly. Play safety, I will see you on the next lesson.